it's Bonnie Southgate here uh, from Pilates Therapy. I just wanted to have a brief talk um, today, a little bit about the book. We've got um, a course coming out and I have one question that does come up quite often um, and that is people don't understand, number one, the difference between the subtalar joint and the tallow curl joint. Um, and I think the confusion lies in that, I'm gonna get my other foot, lies in that they both are joints that uh, the talus is involved in. So tallow is just referring to talus. So crural means leg, basically. So a joint between the talus and the leg. So the, the tallow crural joint is really where you get your dorsiflexion and your plantar flexion from it. So it's where your tibia and your fibula glide over I've got a, a movable um, foot here, but I've put ligaments on it, so I, I might not be able to move it as much as I would like to. So that joint up there, it looks a bit like a knee joint when you look at the tallow curl joint up there, and it just slides back and forth, and the talus is able to translate with the tibia and fibula, a bit like a knee again. So we've got that kind of gliding joint backwards and forwards. It's a little bit more complicated because we've got lat a bit of lateral movement and rotational movement going on um, with the talus in order to put it in the correct groove. And then underneath the talus, it butts up to the calcaneus. So that is your subtalar joint, and, that, and it's obvious because it's sub to the talus bone, and that moves on the calcaneus. And between the, uh, the talus and the calcaneus, you get a little bit of lateral motion going on, which creates your inversion and eversion, or a lot of times with the Pilates people, we talk more in pronation and supination. So the, the lower portion of the talus works with the calcaneus, and then the upper portion of the talus works with the tibia and fibula in that direction. So that bone sits and, and helps create lots of motions of the foot. So that is your talocural joint, dorsiflexion, plantar flexion, and your subtalar joint, pronation, supination. So hopefully that's made that a little bit more clear to you. Um, if you found that interesting, we have a foot and knee day, or we have modules on the foot and knee, and you can find us on www.pilatestherapy.co.uk.